Hey y'all, so I just got in the house. I want to unplug this TV because I can't find my remote. Well, my son lost my battery out of my remote and I bought extra ones and can't find it. Anywho, um, so I am home, but so I am gonna show you guys what I got um, from Target. Uh, I'm gonna flip this camera around. And again, the lighting in this. So I got these and this uh, is $10. It actually was for $12, but I got it for $10. These are wine glasses. And I thought these was really cute. I really like the how stem it is, the bottom of it, and how the top is shaped. I hope you guys can see how that is angled. These came with six of them. And um, again, I went to TJ Maxx and Home Goods. Um, TJ Maxx and uh, the one I went to was uh, together. Um, I got these two trays for my refrigerator. Um, if, can you see it? So like, it's uh, for fridge, freezer, pantry, and more. Space saving, built in, um, handle easy access. You know. Um, so I got two of these. And you can see how they got the pop and apples, different stuff here. So I got just two of these for right now. Um, I'm doing something. I just, just put it in on top of the kitchen, on top of the refrigerator. And I got a pizza pan. And this was $4.99. I got that. Um, what else did I get? I'm in my room. Um, so I'm showing you guys in my room. Um, cause my kids are live right now. I got an egg holder. This is, uh, how many can fit in this? I think 21 or 18, I think. This is 21 egg. It was right there the whole time, Lord. And then I got these two um, fridge bins. I got two of those. Um, got two of those, and I guess you can label them with a um, with a, um, a dry erase marker. I think you can just write on here. I think just on its itself because it's not a sticker. But I might just get a sticker. I don't know. We'll see. But, because I'm not doing it right now, I'm just getting stuff, and then I'm not going to buy too much stuff. I'm probably going to do some stuff this weekend, but I need to budget some stuff out. Um, and then I got me a coffee cup, and I thought this was so cute. And four kids in there, y'all. Four kids. And I got Choose Beautiful, got Choose Beautiful Moments Cup. I think this was such a pretty color. Um, and this was only $3. $3.99, I got it for $3. So that's all that I... Uh, sorry, I kind of flipped the camera. That's all that I got. Um, and...
Okay, y'all. Good morning. I wanted to come in here and say hello. If you guys seen the beginning of the um, video, I showed you guys my food. So you might ever I Tuesdays and Thursdays I try to boost up my protein, especially a lot, a lot. I probably go over more than 20 net carbs on Tuesdays and Thursdays, and the reason why is because of that I'm up, <clears throat> I'm up early on Tuesdays and Thursdays, and I don't get home until late on Tuesdays and Thursdays. My um, so those two days are my busiest days, and I need want to keep stuff to keep be healthy and keep moving, keep pushing. Um, so. I had, I ate the, I ate, I don't think I ate, I, I need to keep track of my fasting, I really do, um, but I haven't kept track of it, my, my voice, my throat hurts, so, um, so you guys showed me pack my food, that little cream that you guys see, that's homemade, um, sour cream, well, not homemade sour cream, it's sour cream store bought, but I buy the Ranch Fiesta, um, powder, and I put it inside and stir it up to make it like a dip. Um, so that I'm eating that with my vegetables. Um, sometimes vegetables can have higher carbs. Those are not too, too high carb uh, vegetables, but they're still healthy vegetables. So I wanna keep my body going, I wanna keep vegetables, and I got some hemp seeds and flax seeds, um, and chia seeds and that to put in my yogurt. I got um, eggs, bacon, I mean eggs and just uh, three sausages and I got, uh, I brought me a wrap. You guys didn't see that part because I put it in the last minute, but I got me a wrap to eat with my breakfast. And then I have a protein, um, a protein shake here. Um, and then you see now I put those four pieces, four pieces of slice of the pizza. Oh, excuse me on there and that's probably going to be my dinner but i just pack everything with me so i can also have something at the football um at the football field with me um i'm not probably going to start drinking on i probably have my breakfast my actual breakfast first and then i have my protein shake on my actual lunch my coffee protein shake on my my actual lunch and then um when i get back from lunch um, when I get back from lunch, I might go ahead and just have my yogurt. I don't know. I'm thinking because I want. I'm thinking I want to take my vegetables and my pizza with me, or I'll probably eat my pizza and eat because the vegetables will make me full. So I'll be okay with the vegetables and dip. So I might just have, take that to the actual football field with me, and then eat my uh, pizza and yogurt at some point during the day. So like I said, I I kind of bump it up a lot. I know it's a lot of food, but I have to keep it up, keep my metabolism going, keep me moving, and keep me going. Um, because I'm at work all day, and then I am now I'm gonna be gone for over two hours. So looking up for work, I don't get home until about eight, eight something. The the I can you guys see me eat the um you guys see me eat the um. I can't the Big Mac in the bowl. <laughs> Jesus. The Big Mac you guys see me eat the Big Mac in the bowl last night, but I did it on a plate. I didn't have any more tomatoes, but it was so freaking good. I seen this girl on YouTube make it, but I've been hearing about it. I'm like, no, I probably won't make it, but it was actually the bomb. Um so if you guys wanna know how I made the sauce, uh how I made the sauce, I will let you know. Just leave a comment below. I should let you know how I made the sauce and I'll let you guys know because that was really, really good. But since I'm getting home late, I don't want to eat that too late because I don't want it to stick to me. But I did eat that last night. Um, so the meat is already done. So I'm gonna make the kids um quick tacos tonight because we're not gonna like, we're, everybody's not gonna be in the bed until about 10 o'clock. So it's it's just Tuesdays and Thursdays is just high, high, very long days from 5.30 a.m. to that. So when I was recording that, that was like at 5.40 in the morning that you guys see me um, putting my food together, my uh, food together. Uh, yeah, so I was putting my food together about 5.30, 5.40 in the morning. So I did all that. I prepped some of it last night. I just made the pizza 
today so i'm not for sure how i'm gonna really plan it out but i think i'm gonna definitely gonna have the veggies possibly for um the actual football field so um so i can just munch on that and then i think i'll be fine because i usually try not to put anything in my mouth if possible until 10 45 on carb up days high protein day oh uh, because i only i only i switched it where this week is my first week where i only had protein shakes on tuesdays and thursdays the premier protein shakes on tuesdays and thursdays the other days it's just actual coffee so i would drink my coffee earlier so i break my fast earlier because i'm drinking coffee earlier um but i don't need i don't really eat as much during those days um just tuesdays and thursdays um it's kind of high protein so if i get anything else to drink um to add more fat like I said, it's a high protein, high fat. So I think I, I'm, I need to keep track, but I think I'm going over 20 carbs. Um, I'll probably go to Starbucks again and get me another green tea. That stuff is so freaking good. Like I can't like it's. I'm telling y'all, it's so good. I got um, the sugar-free peach green tea. I got four pumps of sugar-free vanilla and a splash of heavy cream when i tell you that drink is the bomb it's the bomb.com so since i'm making the kids tacos because i didn't put the taco seasoning on it because i wanted the uh, big mac burger with the hamburger so i kind of took mine out so i'm gonna go so i get home tonight i'm gonna just um finish the rest of it um put water uh finish putting the, the rest of the season to make it taste like taco meat you know what i'm saying because i cooked it enough to, uh make sure it was cooked so i can be able to eat that but i'm gonna go in and re-season it and everything and um everything y'all see what i'm talking about with the taco seasoning because i didn't over season i didn't do too much for it but so all the thing i gotta do um is get they probably want taco shells so I'm going to go on my lunch today and go get um, some more sour cream. Um, I need two things of sour cream because um, I got more ranch dip um, to put into sour cream. The, uh, the, it's the powder, but it's the dip that you can put in the sour cream to make actual dip. That makes sense. Um, so I'm going to get two things of sour cream. Um, I need to get them. I didn't, I only packed, uh, I gotta go pack some Lunchables because um, my son's on football practice. Um, well, what happened, when I put an order in for Walmart, um, for my protein shakes, I didn't know, like, if, if they, um, if I, like, if they don't have it, they'll cancel it. They substitute, and you can say yes or nay if you want it or not. But I didn't know that at first. This is my first time ever doing the actual pickup from Walmart. I, I'm kind of funny. Like, I get my own food. I want to look at my own food, pick it up. But I just didn't feel like it. So, I did the order. Um, they didn't have any more Premier Protein Shakes. So, they substituted it with... Uh, oatmeal protein pie and it's marsh got marshmallows in them i'm not eating that i can't eat that anyway on keto so i gave my two sons that for football and they actually liked it so um i just gave it to them so they only eat those um on the way to football practice once we leave they have a lunchable they 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 do it for two hours uh, you know what i'm saying for they practice for two hours so I give them that I so I gave them their options so they have they have the protein thing I'm gonna find something else to kind of give them too that might be a little bit better again I'm not really it's the first time I ever had it it was like six dollars I don't know so I gave them that they said they liked it so they're gonna have it was four in a pack they had two and then I have two more on the way to football and then um, I pack all four of them a lunchable I have a two-year-old he's he's gonna want something to, to snack on so they got their gummies they um their fruit snacks 
especially for my daughter and my two-year-old because they're just sitting there in the car and they might want something to snack on and I just get four Lunchables. So after football practice, they have a Lunchable. Um, sometimes they'd be okay with the Lunchable, but by they doing so much activity, they might want to eat again because I know even though they had a Lunchable, they were still hungry. So I just gave them um, a corn dog. Um, but I am going to be trying to incorporate more whole foods also for Tuesdays and Thursdays for them. Uh, they're practicing, they're running, they, they need to eat, you know, the foods. But so their kids, they don't burn it off anyway, so. Um, so I'm gonna give them, I'm gonna go pick up Lunchables um, for them to have on the football field and that dinner is already done. Um, so they, if they still hungry, it'll be there. Most likely they probably will be we'll see and then they have that and then showers and all that stuff but so I just want the so that's it I'm on my way to work so I'm about to kind of chill and relax my mind before I have to go up in this place <laughs> so I'll catch you guys um and again it's hard for me to record when I'm at work because we can't have our phones at all and then when I time I get my food I'm um sitting down I'm just trying to relax my mind I, I work in customer service so sometimes it's like I don't want to talk because I've been talking to people I talk to people all day um so it's like let's just get through the day so I will I, that's why I preached kind of showed y'all what my food was before the day started because I might I might not come back but um I will catch you guys you know in a little while at some point today just got on my lunch um I have an hour lunch so I am I gotta get oh sorry this road is not that good over here so I'm about to go to Kroger because I need to grab just like four things four or five things um for the the, the practice field and grab a couple things so um I'm about to go do that I have my um, coffee my cold coffee I don't know if you guys are like me or not I don't feel like this doesn't this is a good replacement but i don't think it as a complete meal replacement like it's called because sometimes when i'm really hungry and i drink this this doesn't it's not like okay um when i drink this it's not like okay um what was i just say like i like to i eat usually my breakfast first then this and then this will hold me content sometimes or vice versa because I feel like it's a liquid. Yes, it's coffee, but anyone can drink hot coffee and um, and it and still eat like a bagel or something. But it's like I still have to have something with it, like not a big meal, but something with it. I don't know if that makes sense. Whatever. So, ten forty-five, eleven forty-five, twelve forty. Okay. So it'll be. So it'll be two hours since I've ate um, before. I, I did this but actually I'm about to start drinking it now so it's been a little less it's been um, almost two hours because only it's about to be a, a 1245 so I'm about to drink this oh this is really good um, I'm about to go to Kroger so I'm just about to leave Kroger I've been here for like 30 minutes um, these are ex this Kroger is very expensive where I work at. It's just very expensive. Um, here, I got the um, Quest nacho cheese and the taco one. I really been craving chips, y'all. Been craving a bag. Um, I got that. I can just put that in the back seat. Um, I got the kids zero um, Gatorade. I only got one because I don't know if they're going to like it. I got that. My son, um, some wipes um they're expensive and then i got um though yeah those quests was like eight dollars and 49 cents for four bags i think the other kroger by my house not right by my house but close to my house by my mama's house <laughs> they have quest chips but um they're saying i mean <laughs> they have quest, quest chips and i don't think they're 849 i think they're maybe seven i mean or six they're a lot 
that's why it cost $64 because those are itself was 16 almost $20 by itself and I got their Lunchables I got they own they like pepperoni the other one was like a dollar almost two dollars and I'm like no it's a dollar um they don't really like the other ones that my sons do but my daughter don't like it because she said the cheese is not that good um but it's the other brand but I think I don't know they're gonna eat it <laughs> like I don't know um and then they didn't so I just got the Starbucks unsweetened medium roast um drink this was um uh, $4.99. I need to find a better. I've, I've spent a lot of money on these. I need to figure out a way. Um, my job has a refrigerator, so I'll put it there. Oh, crap. I forgot the Fiesta dip uh, mix. It's okay. I have ranch, so it's okay. And then I got me three bags of um, Romaine Hearts, two sour creams. And then I found these. This, this is a pack of three. So this was $8.99. But it comes with um, provolone, pepperoni, and salami. And I think that that's not a bad price for all three of those. I thought it was okay price. So I got that, all three of that. And I got two things of sour cream. Um, all that's so gonna go at my job in the refrigerator. And then I got nuts. I just got some um, cashews. Um, and then I got some roasted salted almonds. And then I got uh, this creamy jalapeno dip from Lay's. This is extremely dirty, dirty keto. Extremely. This is it's one total carb, yes, um, per two tablespoons, which is not bad. It's just the ingredients. So this is dirty keto, extremely dirty. Um, and then I got my kids taco shells. I got two packs of these. I only got 10 in them. Um, and then I got them a bag of Doritos for dinner. So all of that's done. I just wanna make sure I have. So now I'm on my way to the gas station. Um, I'm on my way. I really can't taste that uh, cheesecake creamer that I put in here, that uh, syrup that I put in here from Skinny. I really don't taste that. I probably didn't put a lot in it. That could be right. I don't know. Um. Uh. So anyway, but um, or if my sugar's overpowering it, I don't know. But I'm on my way to get gas because as soon as I get off of work at 5 o'clock, I work 25 minutes away from my kids' daycare. So I, And then if I hit traffic, it's all she wrote. Uh, my kid. I think I'm far from the pump, but I ain't trying to be too close. Just park, Melody. Just park that on car and get gas. Not that serious. Okay, so I'm about to get gas. Hey, y'all. <clears throat> so it's 310. Um, if you guys are a little shaky, I'm sorry. So um, how do I feel right now? So I feel a little bit better. I did take me um, a shower. Um, I did take me a shower. I didn't really do too much. I just took a shower, I cleaned up, let the hot water run with me, and I just laid down. I didn't really take a nap because I, 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 I just couldn't take a nap. But um, I did lay down for a minute, take a shower, and kind of cool out. So it's 3.11 right now. I didn't take that other medicine, the one I was supposed to swish and spit out. I didn't do that, um, but I did take that other medicine, which I um, my headache has kind of went down a little bit, so I feel okay with my headache. Um, so right now, I'm on my way to Ross. Um, I got to get my kids some socks. Like I said, they're not going to be here this weekend. This weather is crazy because it was cold, cold yesterday on football. Today, um, the sun is out, but it's still a little bit of cold. 
So, and I just packed them pants and sweats. So, I don't know what tomorrow and Sunday supposed to look like. Tomorrow, I said it's supposed to be 59. And Sunday's supposed to be 61. So, I'm guessing Sunday might be better. Um, so, I don't know. So, if I see a short outfit in here, I probably will grab the boys one just in case. Um, I don't know. I got to take the my son's other shoe back to finish line. Because it's too, I got it too, too big. It's like two shoe sizes, too big. Um, so I need to downsize that. So I'm going to take him Sunday. Uh, so I'm going to probably have to pick him up a little bit earlier from their dad's house. So I can take him. Um, so I can take him to kind of see what that looks like. So I did decide, go ahead and decide that I am going to go over my nephew's um, house's birthday. Um, and it starts at 6. Um, so I'm going here. So even if I get done, I, oh, I got gum stuck on top of my mouth. I had the gum stuck on top of the roof of my mouth and I couldn't get it off. Um, so even if I, once I leave here, I'm probably going to be on my way to go get the, oh, plus I got to get them something to wear for pictures on Monday. So they're all taking pictures on Monday. Um, so I'm trying to find something for them for that to do. Um, so the halves and then plus get my, and then my two year old shoes didn't get processed. So his shoes ain't going to be enough time. So I want to go get him another pair of shoes until those shoes get processed. Um, and then, and then, um, fix my other son's shoe. Even if he can't get that particular shoe. Um, I have to try to find something that I like and but downsize it just a little bit because I got it too big so I can exchange it from at the store. I just want to exchange it. Um, so even if I find something less less than that, they will, you know, of course, give my money the difference from it back into my account. But I need to exchange it because it's too big. But hopefully I can find that same exact shoe because I like them a lot. Um, so I'm on my way to Ross. And I actually never been at Ross. And I heard really good reviews about Ross. It's like a discounted store, but it has a lot of nice stuff in here. Um, then I left my purse in the trunk. So I'm on my way to do that now. Um, just to get that. I'm not going complete shopping because if, again, like I said, if I get done earlier, I'm just gonna go get the boys, go to my mom's. Oh crap, I forgot my thing. So I'll do like a little get ready with me, to get ready with me. Like I said, I don't, know how to do makeup and i really 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 do want to learn how to do makeup um just to enhance my beauty um but just like i don't but i really want like when i got my pictures done for my business i really loved like i wouldn't do that much of makeup like i did for my business but i want to do like a light touch um um, so I'm actually about to run in here, Michael, come on and check on these tables. So I'm trying to find these tables for my laptop because I want to get my desk and stuff together. That's something that I really, really want to do before school. Um, so I'm about to run in here and see what they're talking about. Um, but like I was saying about. Okay, so these are the ones that I was talking about, but they're $69.99. But I heard you can get these cheaper than $69.99. Um, hey, right, I was trying to take y'all in there, but I got sidetracked it. Um, tr looking and trying to figure out what was going on with that raw. So I peeped the game on the new IKEA. So you know the IKEA. Uh, desk with the drawers um michaels have them and michaels have them cheaper than ikea however when people was all on uh wish i knew about this about a year ago was all hot trying to get the ikea drawers and all that stuff like that uh maybe you can spend like 30 dollars or whatever so they made a new contract where the 6.99 the 69.99 is always on sale for the great buy so now those desks are always going to stay at 69.99 which you could usually get them for like $30 when it, the, before this policy started. 
now if i have so she said if i had like vouchers the kid go to it so say if i i don't shop at michael's like that so like if you buy stuff and you they give you like cash back vouchers or whatever you can apply those money vouchers to that but $6.99 you can't apply no coupons on nothing because that's always considered sale so that's what it is and i need two of those for my desk um to pull out because i have the top already i got that measured and cut um at home depot um so anywho i found my kids some stuff they got some really nice stuff from ross so i got my uh four-year-old this and some shorts uh this was five dollars and 99 cents um and then i got him a size four in this it's a three-piece set and it was $8.99 and it says I bring the noise if you guys can see that I'm in the car um I got that and then I got my two-year-old um this little outfit right here with like little ducks on it um it was $6.99 um and then I got this Batman one for my two-year-old and this is a three set it comes with the short sleeve shorts and long sleeve you can rock it anyway it's $8.99 um so I got their shirts for pictures and I actually I love these shirts um it says blessed you see that so um I know it's a boy on it but I got four because it's I really want my two-year-old to wear one if he can't wear this one um I'm trying to see if my daughter can fit one. If she can't fit one, I'm going to see if I can try to find something else. But I'm not about to go crazy if I can't try, just try to find her something different. But um, they, they will, I have a 7, a 5, and a 4. And the smallest one was a 4. And I don't know if I can get away with it with my 2-year-old. So I have to try that on him to see if he can fit the four one but that's what they're wearing with some black um pants or shorts i got my oldest shorts my middle one pants and my youngest one can wear shorts um and then i wanted because there are really you know how daycare pictures are school pictures are they take individually i want them i want the ones together i don't want the ones separate they're gonna do it anyway but i'm not buying i just want the group um, so I'm hoping my four-year-old can fit one and I bought four of them to see if what my daughter can fit whatever I don't use I'm I'm bringing back and they're three. They're only three nine nine each, but I can take my three nine nine back um, And then I got the boys just some socks um, And then I, uh, these are the pants that I got for my middle son um, There's a little detail right there. So I got him those and if he can't fit the shirt, I got him Paw Patrol, but I like it because it says bold, brave, and strong. So it kind of goes with the blessed, so he can kind of like be in the middle of it with this and have his black um, pants on and his shoes. So I kind of looked at it that way. I just got to figure out what my daughter's going to wear, but they're, I found everything at Ross. So whatever I don't keep them is going to go back, but most likely it's going to be the blessed shirts. Um, so... I didn't get my son, my middle, my baby, no socks. So I have to, I'm going to run to the dollar store and get him some, all together. I spent $83. Um, and I pretty got, pretty much got two outfits in one. I got one, two, three, four, four outfits, a pair of pants, two, no, pair of pants, shorts, two back things of socks. This even comes with one, two, this comes with how many pair of socks? 10 pairs of socks these come with 20 pairs so i got a lot of pair of socks for some good deals um so i'm really not mad at it um and, and then the shirt because like i said i got four of these shirts so it's not i'm not mad at it and i got my receipt so whatever shirt that i'm wearing if i can find something for my daughter i will uh do that if i just gotta find her a shirt um, my shoe, my, my two-year-old shoes has not came. So I'm probably going to have to, um, I'm going to cancel that order and, um, going to just buy him some shoes at the store. Or if I don't cancel it, I'll just keep them so he can have another pair of shoes. Um, unless they cancel it on their own. 
um that so i'm actually about to be on my way to go ahead and pick up my kids so i did that so this is what y'all bougie people be spending money on on makeup <laughs> like for real like this is what y'all be spending money on like i just spent 44 dollars on makeup i got me a, a wig cap and um i got me a large concealer brush um uh, a powder brush excuse me uh a dual fiber brush um that what is that hold on yeah uh Hold on. Yeah, that. And then I got me a concealer one. I think I was supposed to get another one. What's wrong with this one? Did I get the wrong brush? Oh, listen, y'all, I'm still learning. A concealer. Like, I'm seriously still learning. Um, I got me, I'm hoping this is not too dark because like it feels like it's too dark i don't know we'll see oh that might not i don't really this looks different on the sun and then on my hand um yeah i wanted to powder but i got a cream so this is my first time getting this. So we'll see how this works. It was $8. That's still kind of high, um, but we'll see. Then I just got me some earrings. Um, I got a dewy, uh, I got spray and I got me um, a concealer correction, concealer correction for up under my eyes. I got me a brow pencil. I got me some lashes and I just got me an eyelash um, applicator so that's that and I have a wig so I'm just I gotta get my wig together hope it, it can last I can't believe I just spent that on the best angle but this is all I got y'all trying to find a way to prop I'm over here rigging stuff for y'all. <laughs> That's the best I'm trying to win y'all from the wall. What's the thing? Can you pop my camera out? Okay. You're fine. Oh. I'm recording, but you're fine. Hey guys, I'm going to go. <laughs> 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 my you eyes hurt so bad. Go and um,
I need a beauty blender. That's what I need. I forgot my beauty blender. God, shit. I'm just gonna take, this is gonna have to work for now because I forgot my beauty blender and I'm salty that I forgot it. So what I'm gonna have to do is just use my face brush because I forgot my beauty blender. idiot. Dang, I forgot my beauty blender. I'm going to use my finger. I can't believe I forgot my beauty blender. This is my angle brush. This is not going to work. You tell my eyebrows. Are they? Did a good job with my eyebrows, actually. And I didn't even go to the shop, so I'm very proud of myself. I actually did a good job. I did a better job than I gave myself credit for. What? Okay. Now the toughest and hardest thing that's about to be done to me is my eyebrows. I'm not good, I mean my eyelashes. I don't know how to put this on, I'm not good at it. So the first thing I'm going to do is measure the lash out first. Um, I hope my mom got hair glue because I didn't even, she usually she does. No, she doesn't. That's a surprise. Yep. She got some. So this is about to be my hardest the hardest for me. I'm gonna actually wash my hands because I don't want to get any concealer on my lashes. Oh, I got hair in my nose. I'm gonna wash my hands. I'm gonna get no concealer on my lashes. I'm just doing my top. My top failed somewhere. Oh, there you go. So my corrector is on. So that's done. So I'm kind of letting that sit on my face right now. Turn my hands off. Again, yeah, this is not the best angle because I forgot my thing at the house. So this is the best that I can do right now. hair on my concealer. See if I need to, this feels sticky already. Man. This actually might be my length. Or am I tripping? No, I need to cut it just a little.
It's good to get your eyelash wet a little bit too. I'm not doing this wrong. Don't judge. <laughs> I'm not good at this at all. So I'm just trying to hurry up. But I need, I'm trying to do this one. Did I look?